Yo, yo, my game positions out there. This is not just elbow. No, shuffle for short. And welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Full of Jelly. Okay, anyway, let's actually start this episode up by battling this, what I'm guessing to be a lass. I came to Crater Cave in search of Pokemon. Okay. Well, that was kind of changed. I have to give him credit for that. At least it wasn't totally plagiarized. But anyway, Paris. I guess we're starting off with a very easy Pokemon this time. And I have leveled up my Pidgeotto a little bit here to level 24. Just to keep up with. Just to keep up with the seniority. And. Oh, Diglety? Diglety? Trio, trio, trio. Diglett is going to be. Coming out very soon here. Come on out, Diglett. Come on out, you little mole, you. <laughs> and I get to whack you. Ah, I should have used Water Gun. But it's no matter, Diglett has as you probably, as you can probably tell here guys, you already know that Diglett has very puny defense, so yeah, I'm not gonna really <laughs> cringe at the sight of Diglett. And I actually have Mega Kick, I don't know why I, <laughs> I keep on using Bite. I I don't know, I just I guess I have that tendency to bite. After all I did to okay, after all I did to catch them, okay. And thank you very much, you cheapskate. Or should I say cheap skank? There might not be any more mushrooms here. I think I ate them all. Well, I guess they're gonna be all trippy, hippy, dippy right now. That's what I'm trying to get at here. Okay, so what is over here on top of these mountains? On top of these layers of cake? Oh, Crater Cave, okay, I guess. We are going to the Mount Moon clone what I'm guessing to be. Hopefully it's not that way though. Hopefully it's a little bit different. But I guess we'll see. And there's no way I'm going over here because it leads to a dead end. Or just a quicker way to jump the rocks. And let's go over here. Crater Cave. I wonder what's in here. Yep, it looks like it... Come on, did you rip this sign off? It... Yep. Yes, you did. It is Mount Moon. It's... Mount Moon, but a different map. It's it's all created differently. And Whooper, Whooper, really. So we won't be encountering the same Pokemon as in Mount Moon. We're just gonna have the same trainers and whatnot. All that hodgepodge. Oh, here we are. Paralyzed Heal. I will definitely keep that because the the Pokemon in Zero City is still. It's still closed for some really weird reason. Like, I mean, am I supposed to flush out Team Rocket in order for the um, event to trigger itself out? I mean, I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what will happen to the, um, that officer. You need to go through this cave to get to Brot's City. Okay. Well, uh, I'm glad we have a city that's named after Brock. Or, you know, if it was just pure coincidence that the next city we're going to is named Brots. I don't know. I mean, you would think that... You would think that a name like that would be none other than Brock. I mean, it'd be none other than... Be, it'd be derived none other than Brock. Okay, so... Two caterpillars. Uh, they both went down. They won't be growing up to be butterfree anytime soon. And Metapod is very close to being butterfree, but not very close. Uh, well, I guess you decided to level Metapod up one more level before you ever decide to metamorphose. Okay. And Robbie, I lost. Yeah, Robbie, Bobby, Gobby. You are now a lobby. Zubat is tough, but if you can catch one, you'll be able to count on it. Okay. And let me guess, I'm going to immediately be spotted if I walk this one step. Oh, yeah! Who, who, who didn't see that coming? What? I'm waiting for my friends to... I think you say the same same old test there, Iris. Hooray, we found Clefairy again for the second time. So what I get to do is I get to mega kick your shins. Mega kick your swirly little Fonzie-like hair there. <laughs> A. I lost? A. D. I think I'm lost. I am living in AD 2015. Anno Domini. Okay. 
In the year of our Lord 2015, I encountered a Diglett. In the year of our Lord 2015, I ran. <laughs> In the year of our Lord 2015, I am going through a very bland cave. In the year of our Lord 2015, I find... I apparently find Al in an apron, who I am guessing is waiting a challenge from me. In the year of our Lord 2015, I ran a... I ran across an Ankeda. Hi, I live in this... Oh, I guess you're not about... You're not gonna battle me. It's not too bad once you get used to the smell. That's pretty new. I don't know why I couldn't... Edit out. I, I I don't know why you couldn't edit the NPCs though in Cerulean City. I mean, they were. Oh, wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. I mean, you will, you 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 need to keep in the originality in order for this to be a really good game. And so far, there you it's basically been hit hit or miss. It's either been this, that, or the other. One of them is. Um, unusually tough Pokemon. Number two, the test needs to be changed a lot. Number three, you really don't want to base the whole map off of Kanto. I mean, I guess it's nice, but you know, you could probably add new maps and all that. Oh, I lost it. I mean, you should you should maintain some originality here, not just... How do, how do you get out of here? It's so big, I may get lost. You don't want to keep out all the dull elements, or else it just... It immediately falls flat. Okay, but anyway. More Diglett. More Diglett, more Whooper, and more Ninkata. Which, might I say, is kind of unusual to find in a cave. Okay, what's... Okay, now we can't... Now we find something more usual to find in a cave. Geodude. Okay, so where exactly are we going here? Are we going inside a volcano? Is there going to be some volcanic activity going on some somewhere underground? Or actually, we may need to find we we may need to fight those two if we ever come around to that. And I'm guessing you're a scientist, and I'm guessing we'll find Team Rocket in here too. Let me just guess. See the thing about. A game lacking originality is I'm able to guess what is going to be next. I mean, there's really no, there's really no plot twist or anything. There's not going to be anything that, you know, it's something that I'm going to be all surprised and oh boy, crazy. You know, okay, fine. Water gun it is and Diglett. You go back to burrowing under your hole. That's right. Burrow in a new hole for yourself. Burrow in a grave for yourself. Let's see. Hmm. Another Diglett. And let me guess, you still have Arena Trap. Yep, I knew it. Oh boy, who who guessed it? Apparently, Alistair Beck knew. Okay, so there we go. And War Turtle is now a tart. He is now a pop, or she is now a pop tart. Chef Tort, what are you doing, you fools? Okay, hmm. Chef Tort from RPG, and I'll oh, hear something that you probably didn't expect me to do. Ha ha! Whoa, you shocked me. Oh, you're just a kid. Yeah, I wanted to do that. I wanted to do that for a very long time. Marcos, starting out with a Geodude, I see. Well, I know how this is going to turn out. I am going to wet your whistle here. How does that sound to you? How does that sound to you? I rocked your socks. I rock your rocks, and I stink on your socks. Hmm, Geodude it is again. Come on, let, let's see a Graveler here. Oh wait, I forgot. Graveler does not evolve until level 28, but wait! We just saw a level 12 ferret just a, a few episodes ago. So, never mind, I guess we won't be going through Pokemon... Well, we won't be going through... We won't be going through um, actual tangible Pokemon logic. Instead, we're going to be <laughs> going through level 11 Gravelers. Wow, shocked again, yeah. Actually, not not shocked, more like dampened. Kids like you shouldn't be wandering around here in the... Yeah. I remember that dialogue. The question is, are a lot of the NPCs going to carry... 
carry around the same dialogue as before. Oh, I remember this hallway. You stole this from Mount Moon. This was not changed. I remember this so very well. This is where I found Paris and Clefairy. Come on, don't... Don't kid me around here. I hate... I hate when people do that. Um... Oh, hello, nerd. Too bad I can't really escape your presence. There are my mushrooms! Well, gee, sorry, hippie. And sorry, hippie, for cosplaying right in front of my face. I mean, I don't think hippies are supposed to do that. Oh, wait, they're, they're kind of cosplaying themselves, you know. <laughs> With their beads and hair bands and tie-dye t-shirts and groovy 70s sunglasses and whatnot. You know, trying to act all like Janis Joplin, but, you know. Okay, I I guess I'll I'll let that slide. Even though you're dressed as a Charizard, you're not dressed as a hippie. Okay, so anyway, you're Richetta. Beat the heck out, Grace Slick. Come on, do it for me. And do it for the good of all Lyndon B. Johnson. Oh no, I'm just kidding. Well, as pro as you guys could probably tell, I'm a hippie myself. I blew it, even though I don't take drugs. Never have, and I never might, even though Pot sounds kind of... Whoa, where am I? You know what? I'm just going to leave drugs up up on the table, and I'm not going to discuss them any longer. <laughs> because drugs are drugs, and drugs are bad, okay? Okay, so... Let's see. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what happens if we head towards the east. If we avoid... If we can avoid any more... Obstacles in our way, like Paris and Geodude, which I have seen for you know ubiquitously. Ah oh, ha ha! Hello, item. Hello, antidote. I will definitely be conserving you because who knows when I will be poisoned in this game. Chances are I'll probably at least once. There's probably a two percent chance I'll be poisoned at least once. <laughs> Okay, so what's up these stairs here? What's up the stairs of... The four stairs of a rock lair? More like Geodude. I guess I'll call this Geodude Pyramid because I guess it looks like a pyramid. It's not a pyramid. It's actually more like a... Um, it's more like a mushroom cloud. Oh, whoa, 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 I saw a Pokemon in the water. I saw a Pokemon in the water. Goodbye, Spinner Rack, but I saw Pokemon in the water, so get out of here. I kick, I kick you into the water. Oh, oh, phone. Okay. Star piece. I'll definitely keep. Lapras? Is that you, Lapras? What are you doing in the water here? Is this supposed to be like Union Cave? Because it looks a great deal like Union Cave, except this is not Friday. When you usually do get to see per uh, Lapras. Okay, what's over here? Die or D if you're German. Let's see. <laughs> wow. And you just—I I love your—I love your whole bonsai opening there. That was definitely—that was definitely changed. <laughs> I actually kind of admire that. Just kind of this one trainer randomly spotting me and saying like "Die" with a club and trying to club me. Oh boy. Oh, some of these guys are just so very silly right now. Of all the silicons I had to run into, it had to be this guy. Get out of here, Brent. Urgh! No, I'm mad! Urgh! Don't do this to me when I'm angry. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. And he becomes the Hulk. You made me mad! I was going to kill you! Oh my god, now I need to call Officer Jenny because you're trying to murder me in cold blood. Unfortunately, I don't have a cell phone with me because cell phones aren't allowed in the Pokemon universe. Hmm. <laughs> Actually, um, actually, I should find the nearest video phone and contact Officer Jenny immediately. Yay for putting in random trainers where I don't really want them. Did you come to explore the cave too? Yeah, I did. Until you showed up. That just kind of, that just kind of stymied everything I had hoped for. Okay, so whatever. I'll let Warto level up to level 28, and then I'll get. Uh, Pidgeotto into the fray. Because Pidgeotto needs some experience as well. 
I mean, you don't want to leave. You don't want to leave your team just hanging there, just remaining very soundly idle. Okay, and Zubat. I guess we'll be finishing off Zubat, and then we'll be going. We'll actually be putting a stop to this episode because we are past the 15 minute mark, and you know how I am with trying to keep a good schedule here and remain remain um. Um, with the medium duration. Losing stinks is so uncool. You know how I am with keeping a medium duration with my videos. I came all the way down here to show off to girls, and unfortunately, you embarrassed yourself, so... I think I'll be... I'll be leaving this here, guys, so next time on Pokemon... Hmm... Pokemon Fall of Napalm, I will be going, apparently, down to this crater to see what that item is way down there, so... Expect that in the next episode, hopefully.